From Ohio to Texas, voters are already beating a path to their polling stations. Well, because I want to make sure that I did get to vote. Didn't want to risk any obstacles coming my way on election day. A sentiment echoed around the country. More than 15 and a half million votes have been cast, voting at a far higher rate than in 2012, according to Associated Press data. They point to an advantage for Democratic presidential nominee Hillary Clinton. She's showing strength in Florida and North Carolina, both must-win states for Donald Trump, as well as Nevada, Colorado and Arizona. Clinton and First Lady Michelle Obama chose North Carolina for their first joint campaign appearance. Voters decide who wins and who loses, period, end of story. And right now, thankfully, Folks are coming out in droves to vote early. It's amazing to see we are making our voices heard all across this country. In the too close to call battleground state of Ohio. Early voting is underway, so make sure get out and vote. We don't want to, we don't want to give this away. Voters do worry about making their voice heard. I wanted to avoid the lines on election day, and I wanted to make sure that if I got hit by a bus between now and the election, my vote would still be there. Who did you vote for? Voted for uh, all Republicans. I'll just uh, avoid the big lines on election day. Well, I think that she's uh, the better of the two candidates, and Trump kind of scares me. In the first week of early voting, officials in suburban Columbus, Ohio, reported nearly 160,000 in-person and mail-in ballots. I can tell you there's a large interest in, uh, in this election. and We anticipate about 45 percent, maybe 45 to 50 percent of folks will vote early this year. Texas has also seen record early voting compared to the last presidential election. By Thursday, more than 250,000 people had voted in Harris County, which covers the Houston area. I just, yeah, I wanted to make sure and get it done and not leave it till the last minute and not have anything go wrong so I could participate. Completely motivated. We've never seen, I mean, we've had record early voting in Houston so far. So, I mean, that's, I think that speaks volumes. Early voting is now underway in at least 37 states. In all, more than 46 million people are expected to vote before Election Day, November the 8th. Tracy Brown, Associated Press.